دو سه سال شدی قرص شب من دنیا ندارم توی شهر من دیوونه میشم تو به تن من میخوری فقط تو به درد من نذارم ازم یه تصویر بد با چمه دونت بری دستگیر در رو بگیری تو بخوای بری یکی بی تو یه جایی بشین بدون پلو من تو محکم جات اگه بری دورم قرصم جاز فاصلمون بدون دشمن ماست پا نزا بیاد جمعه ها به جمعه مهمونی جلو فیلم زنگ زدیم قضا بیاد کاش بمونی تو خالی نشه جات حس بعد من جایی نره با تنمون خورد محکم به هم چون دلامون با هم محکم به هم Assalamu alaikum everyone, how are you guys doing? My name is Wally and that's a really loud dude so we're gonna I hope you guys are all doing fantastic I just kind of want to talk a little bit about Fomity Snaps For those of you who don't know what Fomity Snaps is It's a Snapchat account I created about a couple years ago It was intended for everyone in the world but mainly Afghans I joined, which I love. The original purpose of Family Snaps was to kind of bring awareness and uh, kind of share what Afghan lifestyle is all about uh, because there was a lot of confusion going around um, and a lot of people had negative impression of Afghans in general mainly because of social media and media in general they um, only like to focus on stuff that's horrible because it gets a reaction from the audience so anyways we made fun media snaps to um, have all Afghans around the world kind of share 5 to 10 seconds of um, the highlight of their life from around the world so people can see it and they can kind of like um, interact and kind of get an idea of that we're not all freaking crazy and we're all not all terrorists but what it actually turned out it just kind of became like a really really big family sharing their snaps and kind of want to talk about how it works and uh, give you guys insight on the kind of snaps that will make it a little bit better for everyone so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to uh, log in as Family snaps. And I'm going to record it over here. Hello guys, how's it going? And I'm gonna share it side by side. I'm gonna go through a couple. I haven't opened this in a long time, and there are a few snaps. Hopefully, by the end of this vlog, you guys will kind of have a better idea of what kind of snaps we like to see on uh, family snaps. So let's go with the first one. A snap. Who needs makeup when you wake up like this? <laughs> That's true, man. Hey. That seems pretty fun. Wow. Okay. See, okay, okay. This is perfect. Um, you see how you guys are sending this snap as a as a from your gallery, so it shows up here. There's no way for me to save this except that, but that doesn't go to the gallery. The only other way I can do is if I take a screenshot of the, um, but then I have to go back and crop it and then make it fit the screen. So it's a lot of work and. Don't send snaps from your gallery. It's that way um, you can't take a screenshot or a picture of somebody from their Facebook or whatever. And then... That was the same person. That's a very cute baby. We get a lot of baby snaps. Oh, look at that. It's so cute. I don't know if you're going to be able to hear the wind. What if the whole time is like going boom? <laughs> <laughs> that really suck. I didn't even be ready. Masahil. Okay, see? There's just a blank screen with Masahil Khair. Which. Mazrati? Mazrati. Kayf Bella Mazrati. It's nice flower. Wow, that's a nice flower. More leaves. Nice, fossil, yeah. I hate fossil, it's nice. <laughs> what is this? Oslo Centrum. That's... Oh, he's on... I'm on a boat, man. <laughs> why, why? No, kitty. Okay, so you have a crush on her. She probably doesn't want to be featured on Family Snaps. So when you guys take pictures of other people, it's automatically going to be, I don't know if they gave consent to be seen by the video project. Oh, that's cool. 
I wonder what you're trying to make, man. I want to see that. Please send me the, the final. Like, as you're scrolling through Family Snaps, think of the kind of stuff you want to see and then send that kind of stuff, you know? At least have some food in there, you know? Like, baby, she's so cute. Mm. Oh, she's making a fish. Nine meters altitude. So, how is this beneficial? Like, what, what? See, I can't save this. I mean, that's probably a really good earthquake in Delhi. I hope you, okay, that's, that's pretty relevant, relevant. I haven't used that word for you guys in a long time. Send something relevant. Oh, oh that's not going to come up. <laughs> that's not going to come up. Okay, and one more thing. Look, see, I have to go through, and I can't save these. Please don't send snaps like that. Like, please don't send snaps from your gallery. Salam, can you please add all of these songs to music? Oh, okay, I will do that. Thank you, thank you. Now we were talking about music. You know, you can add the all of these songs yourself. All you have to do is just email me. Uh, your username and um, tell me you want to be you want to add songs yourself and I'll create uh, or I'll turn that account that you have as an artist account that way you can go to musicly.me on your desktop and upload all these songs yourself so if you want songs that, you, that are not there and you have access to it please email me but thank you for this I'm actually gonna take a screenshot of this how do I save this? How do I save this? How the fuck? Anyways, so this um, this friend of mine, uh, she, she seems to be going after the wrong type of guys, you know? I know Haram has stuck for a lot, oh my god, you're not supposed to be dating this and that. But here, people date. I'm sorry to say that. People, you know, that's their lifestyle. They date and they see people and they have boyfriend, girlfriend, and sometimes it works out and they get married. Sometimes it doesn't. You know, it's just a, um, for some people it's time pass and for some people it's that phase of getting to know someone before you commit to them of getting married or whatever. In which case, my friend over here, you know, every time she's with um, that certain person, she thinks she's gonna get married to them, you know? But sadly, she um, chooses the wrong type of guys to do that with, you know? And end up being quite toxic. Uh, so if you guys have any um, advice for her, if you guys, um, cause I tell her like, hey, if somebody's treating you bad, if you're not happy, whatever it is, whether it's relationship, whether it's a friend, whether it's something you're doing, whether it's uh, your work, whether it's your school, what you're studying, if you're not happy, if it's not working out for you, in order to move ahead, switch things up. Then let's just talk about relationships since we're talking about. If you're not happy with it, do something that completely takes you off of that path into a new path. It could be worked as like trial and error. So you're trying all these different, I'm not saying talk to a different guy every 30 days don't do that but I'm saying like watch with the places you're going and talk to people you interact yourself with and if it's not working out leave it drop it that's not it's not the end of the world how many people 7.2 billion people in this planet and you seem to be going for the holes <laughs> I know you don't mean to but, but once you know for sure that this guy is toxic it's probably good for you to like get out of it yeah and it, that just doesn't apply to to relationships either either it could be applied to your work too like to move ahead to get ahead if you're not happy if you're not going somewhere whatever you're doing switch it up try for 30 days if it doesn't take you somewhere if you're not happy do one thing that changes that excuse the direction that you're, you're moving to you know I'm saying? For me? <laughs> 
حال من خوب نمیشه نه با الکل نه قرصی ای شل کن سفت کن بینمون اینطوریشو نخواستی